Hello. Hello. Holy shit. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Oh my god. Hello, everyone. What the fuck? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Shadows, an indie horror game. And we're continuing to left off of stressfully going down multiple layers of freaking hell. We're in negative 13 right now, and we're continuing from there, so let's get back into it. Things are stressful, and I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to just win. Fuck this. I have no idea. We're just going to move on. We still have our flares, so we might have to use them against things that spawn and... Is, is this evil? Will I die? I'm guessing it was hot steam. I didn't know if it was smoke or hot steam just because of the textures, but now we know. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to defeat it or if I'm supposed to uh, disable it or something. Wait, what? It was Lee. I told Melissa to go pay for our room and I gave her some money. That was the last moment I saw her alive. This is what probably will happen to me. So... Am I supposed to... Can't seem to touch it. And I find a way, I have to turn that off. Buy this? Okay. We turn off the hot steam by turning it off way over there. Oh, come on. That, that was lame. It's not spooky. But the public bathroom certainly is. How did foot fucking... G's not working. I have no more flares. Okay, well... While initially not creepy, it... it in the corner, that, that, that is pretty creepy. Ha uh, uh, I see. I, I see. I see where you're doing that. that. That's that's pretty cool. I don't like being in the same room as it, knowing it could just pop around the corner and ambush me. You know, I really don't. I don't like public washrooms of uh, opening all these. Oh. Well, I got a crowbar, so okay. It's it's not letting me bust it down. What do you what what do you want? I don't I, I I don't like the fact that she's still there, but in the reflection, it's awesome. But I don't have any source of light in this hallway anymore. I don't like it. Okay, we got a crowbar, so we're gonna bust something down. But I have no source of light now, so I'm just walking in the darkness. I'm not looking forward to this at all. Alright, well, at least we went downstairs with no problems. But I still have no source of light, no glow sticks, no flares. Floor negative 14. You are done! Nah, maybe. Are you saying I'm done the episode? Like, I'm, I'm about to finish. I don't have a flare for him. He's gonna charge at me, aren't you? Because I can't sprint anymore. But I still have a crowbar! Is he coming at me or what? I don't know if he's like literally like just like inching closer and closer to me. Well, I have to inch closer and closer to him apparently. While well, blind as fuck. I have no flares for him, who knows, maybe I, I could have killed him, but I wasted all my flares, who knows. If there's multiple endings of this game, then I'm going to be slightly pissed. Because I'm not going to replay it to get a different ending. It's a long game, I tell you what. I, I'm blind. Interesting. Alright, well, that was just a slow... I'm still walking in slow-mo, though, so... Something's gonna happen again. I still have a crowbar, though, and I never use it. God damn it. 
Jesus. Is that it? As the shadow attacked you, you instantly lost your consciousness, and you never woke up again. Is that just how it ends? I'm hoping there's no multiple endings. I'm hoping not. Game made by Mr. Kiestku. I'm hoping I pronounced that right. And only, I can only see it as Mr. Kiestku or Kiestku. Hopefully I'm right. But, okay, so models. Do, 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 because I was listening to his music while making the game. Well, overall, that was a good game. I mean... I, I've played a lot of indie horror games, I do have like 600 videos now, and this was pretty damn good for an indie horror game. Uh, no, I, I don't know what to really say, it's just it was good, I am plenty impressed, good job. I'm going to look forward to playing Shadows 2. Anything gonna happen after the end of the credits? No, oh, alright, just back to the main menu. So. I hope you enjoyed Shadows. I this was a good indie horror game, and I enjoyed it thoroughly. And I hope you enjoyed this series also. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a fluff scriber. Go into the fluffer nugget army. It's growing at a nice fast rate every day. I get double digits in subscribers, like 10, 10 to 18 average per day. It's going great. I am enthusiastic about this. Everything's going fucking up Millhouse. Or. Everything's coming up, Millhouse, is what I meant to say. <laughs> Either way, I hope you look forward also to Shadows 2. I'll be playing that soon enough. I'm just playing a lot of Outlast to catch up and get caught up to Outlast 2. So bear in mind, it's an old game. I know it's not going to be popular. I know most people have already seen Outlast, but I got to get through with it too and try to enjoy that too. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed. And until the next time. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be relentless. This is going to be difficult. Hey, he closed the he closed the window for me. What a nice thing. Attention, this game contains flashing lights, quick time events, and spooky scares, jump scares. I spat everywhere.